Hey guys, this is Scott from Trim That Weed. In today's video, we will be talking about the train furnace pressure switch error. But first, what does furnace pressure switch error mean? When a train furnace displays a pressure switch error code, it signifies that the board does not detect a contact closure from the pressure switch. If a pressure switch error occurs, the system will deactivate and your home will not receive any warm air. The pressure switch prevents the furnace from running if proper air pressure is not detected in the venting system, ensuring proper exhaust flow. Additionally, the system ensures your home's safety from backdrifting by shutting off upon detecting negative pressure in the draft inducer motor. The following are some of the common causes of the furnace pressure switch error. Malfunctioning pressure switch. A pressure switch error may occur if the switch is defective or has significantly aged. An aging pressure switch can result in erroneous readings and cause the furnace to cycle improperly. Malfunctioning pressure switch hose. A pressure switch typically has one or two hoses linking it to both the condensate collector box and the draft inducer. Rats or other rodents sometimes gnaw on hoses resulting in holes. Additionally, the presence of cracks or frays in the pressure switch hoses can result in a pressure switch error. Clogged Vent Pipe The vent pipe is usually a PVC pipe that exits one's house through the roof or the side of a wall. The vent pipe can occasionally become blocked by items such as bird nests, wasp nests, or leaves, leading to a pressure switch failure. Now let's look at the best solutions you can apply to fix the pressure switch error. Test the pressure switch. Doing this can help you figure out whether the error is a result of a defective pressure switch. Try the following. Start by ensuring the furnace is not running. Then detach the front access panel from your train furnace to reach the pressure switch. Next, take out the 24 volt wires connected to the pressure switch. Position an ohmmeter lead on each terminal of the pressure switch. The measurement should ideally show zero ohms if the system is actively calling for heat and the switch is closed or a valve close to zero. Should the ohmmeter reading be higher, the switch is likely defective. If the pressure switch is faulty, you will need to replace it. Kindly refer to the furnace manual to ensure compatible replacement parts. Replace the pressure switch. Take off the pressure hoses and clean out any obstructions found inside. Then assess the pressure switch hoses for signs of cracking, fraying, or defects. If the pressure switch hoses are compromised, install new ones. Inspect the venting pipes. Look over the vent pipes to identify any blockages. You can utilize a flashlight or snake tool to check for deeper blockages. If there are any blockages, take them out gently and check to see if the error has been resolved. If you find any blockages like bird nests, follow these steps to remove them. First, detach the vent from the house's interior close to the nest or where the pipe begins. Then, wearing gloves, carefully extract the nest and transfer it to an adjacent tree or thicket. Next, employ a vacuum or air compressor to clear the vent opening. You can put a bird netting to stop birds from nesting there again. Regularly inspect your train furnace, including the pressure switch, hoses, and vent pipes for optimal safety and performance. Thanks for watching.